Hey, it's Zena Warthog Princess. Welcome to another video. If you're new here, welcome as well. And for those that haven't already, please subscribe because at 1,000 subscribers, we're gonna have a giveaway. More to come on that, but we're only about 100 and something away from that goal. So don't be, don't be shy. Okay, first thing I got is, well, it's a box, but it's from um, Paper House Productions. And this basically was a sticker haul for planners. So this is a planner haul. I did get um, a whole bunch of stuff. They were having a huge sale. Like things were 50 cents for a sticker strips and a dollar or two dollars for nice sticker packs. Um, and then like five or six. So everything was about 50% off or more. It was like really, really good warehouse sale. Anyway, I spent too much, but I'm in the acquisition mode. So there you go. About half of them were puffy or um, 3D, so those all went straight to the scrapbook stuff because it's really not practical to have poofy things in the journals and whatnot, and so I left that go. But I kept this box because look at the size and shape. I'm gonna put some duct tape on that sucker and use it to stack journals and things. I just, I, yeah, because there's a bunch coming and they're gonna need some place to call home. But in the meantime, here's all the stickers we got. So I did get, and this is not from Paper House Productions. This was from Amazon. This was the third of the Vera Bradley sticker books that I was talking about. Stick with the plan and planner stickers. This particular one is Violet Cactus Flower is the name of it. It has, just like the other ones, it has the gift stickers in the front. And then, you know, planner stickers, pretty basic. And then some motivational sayings, some more decorative markers. Yeah, you know, basic stuff. It's very planner specific. And then as with all of them, they all have these letters in the back. Um, there's basically just two sheets. So we'll see, I might use those in combination to mix up the colors and stuff, we'll see. But nice little elastic to close it, and it fits nicely right there. So, next big item. Let's just put this box aside. This is from Paper House. It is their brand, Paper House. It is fitness sticker book. Because I'm all about the wellness right now. And this just says, life organized, hit the ground running with foil accents. Cool. So, this has 30 sheets. That's a lot. So, it's like the Happy Planner sticker packs. Um... Yeah, but it just, it's really colorful stuff, you know, variety of things. I like bright, bold colors. And this is a nice mix of different things. It's got the scales, it's got motivation stuff, it's got running shoes, hearts with, you know, the beat across it, water bottles, Walkmans, iPods, whatever. Um... Never give up, never give up, never. There's a whole bunch of those in there. And then there's rest or goal, strength days. And then these ones, actually, I was kind of thinking, would be kind of cool, you know, these little scales, and you can just write your weight on any given day. Now, the wellness journal that I'm using now, or the wellness log, it already, I already have a space for that. Um, and these are kind of big, so you know, I don't want the weight to be the main idea on any given block but I'm sure I will use those at some point in some way. Um, maybe for like a monthly goal weigh-in on the goal page, I don't know, but more to come, yeah. And don't worry, I'm not gonna show you every single sticker and every single book, but we'll just kind of look at some of the things, generally speaking, because there's a, a good variety of types of things. Okay, so we've got HP Moment Makers, clear stickers, two sheets, but this is, it also comes with a pack of glossy photo paper. Hmm. Like, I guess, like a sample pack. 10 picture, because you can print out 10 photos, that's cool. But these are travel related, so, but I like the clear background on them. Here's another travel related one, they're clear stickers. So, this one, these were 50 cents, 50 cents. 
This one I got cactus. I live in Arizona, so I, I do like cactus and they, you know, when they bloom, they're really nice. But that's a lot of stickers for 50 cents. One sheet, but it doesn't say how many. But anyway. And then this one is blossoms. And they're all kind of like the same color, like peach blossoms. And then I got a Harry Potter one because why not? I'm a little bit of a Harry Potter kick after Vera came out with it. But that'll be fun to do like a, a Harry Potter theme. Then we've got some really nice metallic ones. These are like faux enamel. So we got Road Trip, we got Pandas and Cactus. And they're all really cute and they have like this metallic edge. Can you see that? So those are fun. And then I got fish because I fly fish every Monday. So maybe I'll put a fish on Mondays just because. But that's not that many months of fishing. But And then fruit. I love fruit. It's not on my diet though, unfortunately. But eventually it will be again and then this one is several sheets it's 91 pieces i don't know how many sheets but they're they're like layered levels so you can like flick up the next one if i can get my finger in the right place so they're variety but they're nautical themed or beachy very beachy but they're kind of metallic but they're on a clear backing so more cool stuff and then more enamels I got a patriotic one for Washington DC and glamping cause I like to glamp and Halloween. These ones are cardstock stickers. So I, like I said, a lot of different variety in the types of fabrication of them, but I love Halloween. I do. It's not my favorite holiday, but it's one of the top ones. And then more camping cause I do, I love the outdoors and I'm feeling especially cooped up right now. And monsters, I just think little monsters are so fun. Yeah, so super cute. And they come with these um, like border stripes too. So these would be great for scrapbooks. It's a nice big border, but I can cut it in half and use it in my planners as well. And then Italy and Spain, I recently did a trip. So if I do end up backlogging in my travel log, that trip, it was epic. It was 57 days on the ship, five cruises in a row, Mediterranean, Greek Isles, Transatlantic, mm, Cozumel, and Panama Canal. So that was, that was pretty good. It's worth backlogging. But then I got this, isn't this adorable, this cute little box. It looks like the Chinese takeout box. <laughs> but this is space stickers. It's just a little roll of space stickers. And I'll just leave it in the box. The, the one end is tethered and um, but there they are. So just little fun little space stickers. So good. Definitely can reuse that theme more than once or incorporate it with other stuff. And, you know, lots of ideas, lots of ideas. There's a vision, generic vision. Okay, now the rest is washi tape. This one I got from Amazon. Through the really skinny ones, there are 48 rolls. So uh, like when it arrived and there's this tiny little thing, I was like, is this right? But then, oh yeah, they are. They're skinny little rolls and sure enough, there's 48 of them in there. But it's a nice variety of colors and patterns and whatnot. And so I, I didn't have, up till now, I didn't have any of the skinny stuff. So this is perfect to just give a good big jump start. And it was like, I don't know, five bucks, eight bucks, something. I'm very, very reasonable for what it was. Very reasonable. Okay, and the rest I just got to add to the collection. We've got three of them from, no, yeah, three of them from Harry Potter. We've got this one that has um, a skinny, they all have a skinny and a fat, or a thick and thin. <laughs> but this one just has like stars and, and kind of a, a night nice sky looking thing. And then it has all of the iconic little things like Hedwig, broomstick, books, his glasses, the snap, snitch, sorting hats, you know, that kind of stuff. But that'll be fun, especially in combination with the other stickers. And then this one is, oh, what does this say on it? I have no idea what it says on it. Oh, it looks like the house names, Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravensclaw, okay, yeah. So the skinny one is the house names, and then the thick one is the house crests. And it has like a gold seal on the top, a gold line and a bottom. So that's cool. And then this one has, <laughs> this is so cute. Okay, so it has 
I don't know if that's glasses or whatever on this thin one in gold. But the bottom one is these cute little like cartoony characters from Harry Potter. So that's fun too. All right, that's it for Harry Potter. Then I got a camping one and this is thick and thin also, but it's got like a truck and trailer, some trees and it goes around and then like a camo thin stripe in green. This one is floral. It has just a green one with dots that goes around and then these painted, I think they're pansies or something. But nice variety of colors. Then there is, these were all a dollar by the way. So this was a dollar per, so this is a great deal. This one is doggies. So the, the thick one has doggies, really cute. And then the thin one is red with golden paw prints all along. Then I got a, now this one's interesting. Well, I'll save these two for last actually, we'll come back to it. Um, this one is sunflowers. I got sunflowers in my kitchen by the way. Love, love, love sunflowers. And it has some golden accents in it. And then the other one is just a checker with white and like a lime green. I know the lighting is terrible, but there you go. Now you can see it. Yeah, so that is cool. And then these two, these two are scratch and sniff. Now, who to thunk? Like, I don't even, okay, this one is grape mermaids. And look at this, it's such a cute little, Pattern. And purple is my favorite color and my niece loves mermaids so I thought even if I just write a little note to her with some mermaid tape on it that would be super cute. But scratch and sniff grape. Okay it's very very faint. I don't want to scratch it really hard but yeah, it's not really much sense at all but yeah it doesn't smell like nothing but it's not really grape either. But Okay and then the other one is watermelon. My number one favorite food in the world. Um, so it's just a watermelon. You could put the, the rind up or the rind down or the rind on the side. But it's also scratch and sniff. Let's see if this one smells. It smells like watermelon. Eh, it smells like something. Kind of watermelony. Hi, Kelly. You want to say hi? Yeah? Hi. We go look that way. You're facing the wrong way. Okay. Yeah, we just got out of the pool. All right, well, thanks for watching. That's it for this um, planner sticker haul. I still have another haul to come. It's Vera. So these are all out of order, but there you go. Washi washi. See you again in a moment.